What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about the new Gunsmith 2.0 in Modern Warfare 2. And there's some in the community that feel like it's a bit too grindy or it was at least reworked to kind of how it's working right now in game. I really thought when we saw it in the beta, the new system was a pretty unique idea considering you have to unlock attachments for different, you know, or, you know, kind of these group attachments, I guess, with the different guns in the game. So if you look at the M4, for example, there's so so many different receivers you can put on that M4 to turn it into a different type of weapon from an AR to a burst rifle, of course, to a DMR, to a LMG, to a sub. But a lot of people are complaining that it's a bit too grindy considering you have to use other things in the game to unlock some of the best attachments for weapons that aren't really even in that group. And one of the complaints that I have seen a lot of players talking about as of late is to unlock some of the best attachments, uh, best attachments, excuse me, for shotguns, you have to actually use an SMG. A lot of people were also complaining if you have to unlock, uh, if you want to unlock all of the M4 attachments, you have to use pretty much close to every gun in the game. And that has been something that I think a lot of people in the community were not expecting when they saw the new Gunsmith 2.0 system in the beta because we really didn't have a grasp on how in-depth it was going to be. And I'm kind of curious how all of you feel if you've been playing Modern Warfare 2. Would you have liked to have seen the system refined a bit to where these attachments may stay more to the categories of, you know, like assault rifles, shotguns, submachine guns, and not really crossed over? Are you kind of happy with this new way that they are doing the attachments in game? To me, it feels like for some people, it's going to be way too much of a grind. For others, they may enjoy it. The one thing I can say that I do like about it is I am interested in the way that it allows you to, or really kind of makes you use stuff that you may not normally use in past years' games. A lot of people would not use some of these weapons. You might, you know, go out and make a class, mess around with it for a little bit, but a lot of people are messing around and using and doing uh, different things, different weapons that it would not have in the past. And I think it really opens up the field when it comes to at least pub matches of what people are using and what they're trying out and kind of how they're mixing up their play styles considering on, or kind of considering on what weapon they're going to use, uh, you know, to unlock a certain attachment. And you never know, you may find a gun that you really like. Uh, if it's something you're not used to using, you know, all the time or something you may not have used if this new Gunsmith 2.0 system was not in the game. So anyway, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Let me know if you like it. Let me know if you don't. Let me know if you'd like to see maybe it just kind of refined a bit. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.